Hello there, everyone. Osage Orange here, and welcome to another episode of Let's Play Minecraft Series 2. We are here on episode number 44 of this series. Do appreciate everybody who has come out. I hope that your guys' time zone, whatever your guys' time zone is, is wunderbar. So, let me go ahead and quickly uh, take care of Discord Landia here. Boop. So, uh, over the weekend, um, I was able to do a fair amount of um, prep work for our stuff. Able to get um, um, some stuff ready for our current project. We're going to be what we're going to be doing today is. Uh, we're going to be working on our pavilion that is on the agenda today. So that is the um, uh, goal for today is to be able to uh, work on that. So the um, Stuff we got going on and all that. Um, got a bunch of um, um, blub blub, um, uh, <laughs> got a bunch of oak, dark oak, um, done in. Uh, so we have the um. Um, we have the supplies. We need to be able to build our uh, stuff. Um, let's see here. What else? Um, also, I was also able to get some mining in. So hopefully, uh, before we wrap up at the end of the month, we will be able to, um, um, get some more work done on the um, item sorter or at least that will be DOS plan that'll be the hope so um, let me go ahead and get that started that started there we go huzzah there's chatbot all I gotta do is just wait for the launcher to do its thing Come on, launcher, do your thing. It's just like, eh, 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 er, er, why is this so freaking heavy? It shouldn't be this heavy. Ow, oh, this hurts. Twee, please stop. And my like, launcher, please do your thing. There we go. All right. So, let me go ahead and uh, get that uploaded. There we go. So, yeah, we're going to be doing, um, as I said, we're going to be working on the... Um, um, the pavilion. So, um... Come on. There we go. So anyway, I did have to make a slight adjustment to it. Uh, I realized that I wanted another uh, block right here in between this pillar, uh, the pillar right there and the pillar right there. And so each of the corners here uh, has been modified. It's uh, from last episode. So it's actually gone out a couple blocks this direction. So, um... I just wanted to make sure we were all on the same page. So first things first. Uh, did that turn? It's my headset, probably. Yep. My headset was off. I was like, why can't I hear anything? All right. Uh, I think I'll leave the chiseled 
nether brick stairs there. I mean, uh, chisel nether brick uh, blocks there for now. I know I want some nether brick. Uh, oh boy. Gotta see if I can fix this pick. Um, let's grab the stark oak stairs. Gonna need the axe. Grab some chests. Need my uh, fence. Um, let's see what else. We'll leave the uh, bedroom where it is. We're going to need all these guys. Oh, wait. Don't even have room. Well, let's see here. Put our chest there. Let's go ahead here and. Uh, Put this down as our supply chest. As soon as I remember to do stuff over, dip. <laughs> Go ahead here, we're gonna snag our dark oak. Much of our dark oak. Grab that extra stuff if we need it for more stone brick when we need it. Excuse me. Most of this here in the chest for now. Let's quickly head to bed. All right, let's see here. Um, all right, so first things first, had this idea. doing the corners kind of like this um you know i have the dark oak um a little bit like that and then Sort of have a plan a little bit like this. Let's uh, let's quickly uh, get to an elevated spot here. So sort of have a plan like this, as you can see. Um, I was thinking perhaps doing the center. I was like um, as well, but then I thought eh, that, that's probably a little too much. So we'll just you know I was like oh oh let uh, whatever tree decides for the moment sort of thing uh, come along so um and we'll be doing the same sort of thing over here on the other end so oops Oh my goodness, I, a boo-boo, or what initially looked like a boo-boo, turned out to be perfect timing. Let's go ahead here and uh, get that little bit out. Go ahead here and uh, finish this sort of lace work. Not even sure if I'm using the 
term lace in this manner correctly. Oops. out at another angle and I was like oopsies all right let's take a look see here yeah I like tree likes I, I, I wanted a little bit of a dark oak patterning within the um, the stuff here yeah I'm not gonna worry too too much about these here at the end probably going to be just a little too much. We do need to keep the dark oak on us uh, here. So, oh, ooh, 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 <laughs> tree just had an idea. Tree just had an idea. Offer, it keeps it dark, but at the same time offers, you know, a little bit of a transition. Oops. I don't want to have too much of the um, chiseled nether brick here. But, you know, just a little bit. And I think that here, here along the sides, we're just right. Oops. Wrong place, tree. Well, maybe it'll be a little too much with uh, all that nether brick. Yeah, we'll figure this out. All right, so, um... Go grab. I know I got a stone cutter over here by the B uh, center. Let's go ahead here. Snag that bad boy. This way I'm not having to worry about constantly making trips either inside the industrial center or over here to the B center. I should have grabbed a crafted table walls there, but did I know? All right, so what I was thinking. Oops. Ooh, that is an idea. Ooh, Twee just gave himself an idea. We'll do. Each corner be like that. I'm deliberately leaving the one block that can't be filled. I'm leaving this block right here as I thought, why not put in a shroom light? Give it a slightly um, ethereal feeling, you know? Let's go get, a sh get ourselves a shroom light or two. That's one thing I forgot to do. I forgot to go on a trip to the nether to get more, um, glowstone. I knew I was forgetting to do something. Alright, let's take a look see what we got so far. Yeah, 
Yeah, that, this is starting to come together. I like that. Sort of uh, the, the edge, of the darkness edging right here. And I think I might actually, uh, well, ooh, that's an idea. What if... Just gave myself an idea. We'll put a shroom light right there. Same on the other side over here. Let's wander on over. Place a shroom light. Take a yeah, that offers a little bit of contrast. Yeah, this is starting to come together. All right, so now uh, let's go ahead here. I don't want too much of a fan of chisel. Uh, Quartz, though. Quickly head over here and get our crafting table while I'm thinking about it before I forget. Don't want to be a dum dum. Mm. That way we can be able to make up some stairs because we're going to need a metric butt ton of stairs. Oops. That's one thing. I think I've seen somebody mention it, and I was thinking about this just yesterday. Is, um, we need some sort of woodcutter. Oops, don't need the stairs. So let's see here. What I'm thinking for here for the middle section is, um,. One of the fun things about having to build outside is having to worry about the um, sun going coming up and down. Building by myself uh, off camera. Oops. One of the things. Oops. One of the things I do is I don't really worry about bo bother with um, um, putting uh, about the sun. You know, especially if I'm you know I was building up the uh, the um, the hopper lines and all that chest for the storage system the item sort I really wasn't too bothered working uh, in, at night yeah yeah that's nice now I do have a little bit of a, sl a slight variation on this theme of the nether brick and stone brick um, I'm going to do since this is ooh. Make sure here. Hmm. My tree 
brain is wanting to do something different because I, I want something uh, I want something similar, but at the same time, tree brain is going do something different. Oh, no, no, let's not do the blackstone. I don't want to do, you know, sort of the opposite of this, but at the same time, I still want to do something different. Let's go take a quick look, see inside. Take a quick look, see here at our types of blocks. you guys I am just scratching uh, my key here I'm trying to think of something part of me wants to use brick but I don't want to Obsidian doesn't feel right. Gosh, guys, I, I'm just really scratching my canopy. We just might have to do is do a similar sort of, let's just go ahead here what we'll do is we'll do this let's just go ahead and do the um core parallel lines of worth of um another another i'm calling another brick another rack another rack is the raw material department is duh like the new sound effect yeah, for uh, walking on uh, another bird. we get this all done. You know, um, I used to watch the YouTuber uh, Daedalus822 back in the day. And um, I don't 
watch him. I don't. Uh, last check, he's. Uh, I think he's uh, got some IRL stuff going on. So, but um, I don't think he's. Yeah, he's doing quite as much uh, content production because of IRL. It actually looks pretty good. And actually, now that I think about it, it looks pretty good. But um, <laughs> I just. Um, Back in his old Bill Baker Go Home series, um, I was thinking of him uh, when he was building his watermelon farm, how he would do, uh, he did it on the live stream, he actually fell asleep during the live stream, but it was dirt, dirt block. Let me see if I can find that. Let's see. Uh, uh, All right, I think I may have found it. Eight. All right, I think I found the bit that I'm trying to remember here. Uh, don't think that's it actually. There was one of his live streams, I remember, one of Data's live streams, where, um, let's see, how big, how big, let's see, three, three, yeah, let's do, let's do three each, so let's see, there's two, one, two, three, it was one of his live streams where, um, Where uh, he, uh, for that, that I remember, um, and these guys here in the middle are going to be tall. I'm just building them all up to the same level so that we um, have our stuff. But anyway, um, it was one of his uh, live streams where he... Um, where Data was busy building his sugarcane farm, and um, three, one, two, three, and um, it was getting towards the end, and he literally fell asleep. Whilst working on the farm, and um, he, um, ow. he literally, as I said, he would literally fell asleep. Um, uh, IRL while playing the game. And he had a creeper sneak up on him. And creeper went boom. And um, when he woke up, he was like, oh my goodness, what in the bloody blazes happened? You know, he, he was literally pissed off at the fact that, you know, he'd fallen asleep. And, you know, a creeper had 
blown him up. And of course, he fell off the, um, where he was building. And, um, let's see, oops. So what I'm trying to do here is, um, that is a marker. Yeah. I think I may have to go higher on these guys. Because what I'm wanting to do is, um, let's see here, what we can do. Is I want, let's see here, oh, oh, almost uh, missed this guy, one, two, three. No, no, that's still too short. Yep, I hate when I do that. What I want is um, this sort of thing right here. This sort of thing right here is... Um, doing that so let's see here what I need to do is get uh, some of that dark, dark oak right there Place that guy there. Move that guy. Oops. Uh, double oopsie poopsies. Let's go ahead here. Now that I've got something. Uh, hello. Eee. Back here, stupid thing. We'll just go ahead and uh, build up some uh, temporary scaffolding like that. Let's see. Have this guy be in parallel with that. And in parallel with the pillar. One of these things where you know you're having to build a roof. I'm having to build roofs and uh, in parallel with the pillar. Dusty scoot. So then, what I do is this. Build it one over. Cap tree. Now building the one o building the initial couple few is always a huge pain in the arse. But 
but uh, it's a case of, you know, once you get it going, it's always easier to build. I know it's a little bit uh, more resource intensive to do do it like this, but um, I would rather have the. Um, have it done like this, so is that, um, it's a little less, uh, it's a little easier to install the stairs, you know? <clears throat> Excuse me, so, let's go ahead here, get that one started. Gonna be. What was it? I'm gonna have to. Oops. I want to go check out my 1.8 world where I originally came up with this design. As I remember. Um. Yeah. Let's. Uh, let me just sec here, guys. I gotta pull up my 1.8 world. Literally going to have to go extract it. And uh, let's see here. Come on. Yes. Yeah, it's, uh, let's see here. <laughs> Excuse me. Okay, let's get it loaded up here. Uh. Last version this guy was through who was one ten two. So this guy really needs to be quote unquote updated. But they see this is why I don't this is why I always keep a um you know, a backup of uh my older worlds in a separate location and I always use a copy. What I do is, um, for all the saves I back up, uh, I put them in a 7-zip. Let me go ahead and I'll drop a link to the, to the website there. 7-zip is a, um, a compressing, um, um, file system, uh, the, it's a zipping system, so, uh, um, you know, kind of like, um, 
um, you know, WinRAR or uh, your standard .zip um, stuff, and um, um, so basically, it's, uh, but it's able to do a little bit better overall compression. So if you say had 500, uh, a set of 500, set of files worth 500 megs, and you had, about three, let's see here, just a second. Let's see here. Um, okay. Oh, let's see here. If I remember my way around. Let's see. Uh, here we go. Here's the here it is. Here is the original one. Aha, I thought I was remembering that right. Aha. You see here like I said it's I'm gonna have to go do a slight little bit of tweaking. Have to go do a little bit of tweaking, but as you see, the original supports, uh, the original flare, they extend out by one block. <laughs> uh, gosh darn it! I remember it was such a pain in the arse to have to get all the quartz to build the uh, telescope over yonder. And as you can see, you know, just like what we're doing in this world. Got a nice square, or in this case, for us, rectangular, but we're having our central evil tower. And all that, so. So. Let's see here. I'm going to deliberately fall off. So what we'll do... There we go. There we go. That feels a lot better. That feels a lot better. I mean, yeah, it's obviously, you know, going to be somewhat different. Let's go ahead here. We're going to snag up all that uh, stone brick. And yeah. So let's see here. I'm going to go ahead here. Wait a minute. Let's see here. Let's double check. Yeah, yeah. It needs to be. I was thinking. God, that looks weird. And I was thinking, oh, wait, right. Duh. Each level, when it comes up, will have a. Um, Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do 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 do. Worrying over nothing. Worrying over nothing. Yeah, this one is of course going to be somewhat bigger, so uh, obviously the proportions are going to be different. But um, going away back to seven zip. Excuse me. It's raining. So I'm going to go ahead and do that temporarily so I can mute the weather. So as that, uh, it's also sundown. Well, almost sundown. Anyway, back to 7-Zip. Um, the, um, 
So anyway, if you've got like, you know, 500 meg file, group of files, under the seven standard zip uh, format, you might be able to get that, you know, if under the best possible compression, you might be able to get down that down, you know, and of course it all depends on the file types, what you're actually compressing. But, um, um, going to quickly go to bed here. You know, you might be able to get that down to, say, 400 uh, megs. Oops. Uh, whereas so with 7-zip, you might be able to get that down. And, of course, like I said, it all depends on the... Uh, um, file types and all that. Because, you know, there'll be... Um, some file types that are um, obviously going to be more compressible. They're, they're easier to compress than others. And um, um, so you might be able to, with 7-zip, you might be able to get the uh, files down to 375 or even 350. All right, so let's see here. Let's do that. I'm going to put out a temporary block right there. Rats. Almost with splat. trying to do here ouch is um get up to the top or the equivalent of where the top would uh, you know be oops there we go come on Definitely living up to the uh, Daedalus 822 spirit of build big or go home in this case. Yeah, it's starting to feel like it, guys. Let's see here. Um, what I want to do, where in the bloody blazes, let's see, parallel with this guy. What I want to do is um, gonna put a lightning rod right there. I'll deliberately leave it exposed. And uh, put a lightning rod right on top. So. Here and do the same thing over here. There we go. That way, uh, we help make sure that we get uh, lightning rods installed. We'll, uh, I'll worry more about the other lightning rod locations as I build up the roof, and I'm going to do that off camera. Um, as much as I possibly can. Let's 
let's see here. Go. Yeah, having uh, these support uh, things will really help us out. Let's see here. Me too. Oh, let's go ahead and go. Ouch! Ouch! This guy will help us out twofold. Of course, we'll have another lightning rod. I hate when I accidentally press my E button. So let's see. We're going to need two more level, three more levels up. And that will get us there to the exact middle. So. Go, huzzah! Oops. There we go. I hear White Cat moaning in his sleep. So the next one is the, the final, is the top level. There we go. Here's the tree. So what I'm going to do here, yeah, let's go ahead here and uh, finish replacing those stairs there. Is uh, since this is going to be the top level, what I'm going to do, I'm going to put um, periodically, probably. Uh, let's see, one, two. What was the forget, what was the range on lightning rods again? Um, Twenty eight blocks. Yeah. So we'll build this up a block. We'll both we'll build these all up a block. So probably let's see here. Let's see that's one, two, three, four. Let's 
do that. Boy, I might have to recompute. I'll just do that there. We'll place the two here at the ends, and then uh, we'll recompute the uh, ones for the middle. That way I don't done you too bad. I'll just go ahead here, over here, and um, put in the three final um, blocks there, and we'll uh, fine-tune here in a bit. Let's see here, quickly get those out of the way. Nice and tall, almost as tall as the house in some ways, but uh, also nice. Oops. Let's go ahead and see if we can't hit the hay. There we go. Oh yeah, I like. I very much like. Nice and tall. Now let's let's just work on two at a time, so Uh, don't worry, I will do the staring part off camera. Because I'm going to want to fine tune that part. One, two, three. And of course, you know, it's uh, going to be a huge pain in my arse. And yes, we trees do have arses, so. All those leaf blocks right there are bothering the heck out of me. Uh, excuse me. Ah. Dum dum. This is why, of course, I went and did my tree farming, or a big chunk of the reason why I went and did my tree farming. I knew I would need a whole bunch of wood. Gosh darn it. Now I'm suddenly thinking of um, Star Trek VI, The Undiscovered Country, uh, the Battle of Kitama between uh, the USS Enterprise A and the USS Excelsior. And um, 
with the uh, ship commanded by General Chang. I'm suddenly thinking about um, the line where Chang goes, uh, he's qu quoting Shakespeare. Cry havoc and let slip the dogs of war. Uh, there's the, uh, you know, um, at that point in the battle, uh, Excelsior is about to show up and, uh, but, uh, Dr. McCoy and Mr. Spock, they're busy, uh, altering a, uh, Photon torpedo, and um, and um, and um, I think actually they the Excelsior had shown up, and um. And it was, uh, Chang was busy targeting both ships. And, um, then of course, um, the, um, they get the Bones and Dr. McCoy, uh, that, that, Bones and Mr. Spock get the torpedo ready. You know, he says, where's that drawn damn torpedo? She's ready, Jim! Lock and load! Fire! And then, of course, Chekhov pushes the, the launch button, and, uh, you know, the torpedo using, uh, the, uh, its sensors, uh, following gas trails and all that, as I remember. Um, hey boy. We're going to have to go almost go splat. Yeet. Goes, uh, but, uh, they go, uh, but yeah, it's, uh, and then of course Chang. Oh. Oopsies. Um, you know, goes, you know, uh, and then Jane goes, um, to be or not to be. And of course, his, uh, the initial torpedo, uh, damages the ship to where it disables its, um, the, um, cloaking device, its cloaking systems. And then, of course, Sulu goes, target that explosion and fire. Fire, Kirk also says. And, uh, Starting to look like it though. Look at that, we got a traitor over there. <laughs> starting to feel like it. Yeah, I know it is rather tall, but, um, you know, uh, a great evil base like the one right over there, and uh, I did a decent uh, Japanese style sort of ziggurat, requires a great pavilion.
What you got, Mr. Trader? Ooh, blue eyes. Could be better, of course, on the pricing, but that's just me. All right, so what we need to do. It'll be one, two, three blocks out for the roof on this other side. And it'll be third block out or fourth? Fourth block out. One, two, three. Oops. see here. Put that there so I have a reference. We'll go ahead and build here. Not yet. I haven't come down there yet with the, uh, what's it? Did I get this all lined up right? No, I didn't. Did, I did, a uh, tree's gun done goofed. Let's quickly head to bed so that I can, uh, anti-dum-dum. Now oh, you see, this is why, you know, the, it's that old saying, you know, measure twice, cut once. work our way up just uh, prune by one block ow at least we're saving a little bit in resources let's take care of these freaking blocks here Blazes out of me. The tree farming I've been able to do. I have got a metric button of uh, Lee, I'm not leave sticks available from the um, um, farming I've been doing well that of course will help help me make up torches I've also over the weekend I also did some running on the sugarcane farm getting the um, 
huge amounts of sugar cane that I got processed. Let's see, there are all, here are all the sticks I was talking about. You can see all those bone blocks. Got to fix this. I would just, uh, I just wish I had more time in the day to be able to do Minecraft stuff. Unfortunately, I can't. Should hopefully be enough to be able to get this project done. Let's get those out of the way. And a few more uh, bits of what's it. few more. Come on. Please. You can do this. There we go. Oops. Double oops. There we go. So once, uh, let's see, we should be able to, uh, well, at least get, um, uh, let's see here, we'll at least get uh, this little bit here up and running. And then, uh, if I hadn't, once again, I had one of these nights where I had trouble sleeping. And, um, and all that, so. If I hadn't had trouble sleeping, we probably would have been able to have more time. But, of course, stuff happens, so. Oops. Ease. Oh, oh, I had an interesting thing happen to me uh, over the weekend. Um, I was out running uh, an errand yesterday, Sunday. Oops. Oops. And, um... I was on my way home from my errand, and um, on for, uh, the way home, I had to um, be at a um, railroad crossing. You know, it was, but it was the best, fa most efficient way for me to get home. And um, unfortunately, I got there just as a train was coming up. I was like, oh. I mean, I love trains, don't get me wrong. Like, oh gosh darn it. I just, I, I couldn't beat the train to the, uh, to the railroad crossing. 
However, you know, I thought it was going to be, you know, a, like a regular freight train. Turns out that it was uh, a maintenance of way train. It was a single locomotive followed by, uh, it was two or three, um, of the cars that, uh, it was a BNSF train. And, um, But yes, the there's like two, three cars behind it. It was a maintenance of way train. Darn it. It's hoping to get uh, the guy recovered. But yeah, it was um a maintenance of way train. Uh, it's really starting to come together, guys. I should have uh, done this first. Put the thing, then yawn down to recover it. But yeah, I was like, at first I thought, those cars look weird. Oh, wait, it's a maintenance of way train. Getting there, guys, we're getting there. So yeah, it's the, uh, the law of unintended consequences, you know? Oops. come down here while I'm thinking about it bring this support pillar up hello there ONG how are you doing hope your time zone is doing wunderbar ah! almost went splat hope you're doing well today let's see here go ahead here since we got this one two yeah it's uh, I need to um, I think it's uh followage I think it is there ONG Huh, I guess that, uh, gosh darn it, we're obviously on two different things here, ONG, and it's night time, well, it's almost night time, go ahead here and quickly do that, put in our, oops, thing there yeah today we're working uh doing our work here on the pavilion um as you can uh oops don't press the t button as you can see we're starting to get this thing put together it's gonna be an epic structure let's see here Let's make sure I do this right. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, geez, Louise. I hate when I do that. All right, let's see here. Well, well, um, ow, dum dum. 
mean letting go of my shift button. Trying to do this. I can have that be out there. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. Unfortunately, uh, wood, at least stairs, don't seem to come equipped with magnets. So, set face. Set face. Or at least in, they don't seem to have nails and, um, Minecraft, so, uh, oopsies. Yep. Those guys line up. Huzzah. All right. Let's quickly get all this bit here fixed. And let's go downstairs and uh, perform the OCD test. Pick that up. Yeah. Yep, yep, yep. That's what I want. Hello. Yes. I wanted to see how uh, epic this is going to be. Oops. Let's quickly go ahead here and... Uh, Bring these guys out so uh, I'll have something to work off of. Good stuff. So I hope you've been, uh, life's been treating you well, ONG. As for me, work full time at Home Depot has been absolutely bloody crazy. Metric butt ton of work. And, um, been able to get some of my personal uh, projects, getting stuff organized done. So that makes Tree happy. So, hooray! All right, let's go ahead down here. Move this a bit here first. that same trader we saw a little bit ago. Just wish I'd remembered to go get some, uh, oops, some more glowstone. Unfortunately, um, kind of brain farted and forgot. <laughs> Never fear. And always do that another time. Let's just worry about these three. Tree, you know, use the three on the bottom. One, two, three. Oops. I hate when I uh, don't have a. And when I place myself in the place of the block that I'm trying to place, you know? Where the 
a sec here, guys. I'm gonna need to stand and stretch. My roots are suddenly getting on the, they 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 want to move. They want to move. They say move, tree, move. Arrgh. Stretch. Oh, stretching feels so good. Uh. Oh, yeah, it's as I was saying, uh, work at Home Depot has been absolutely bloody crazy. And, uh, two, three, two, three, one, two, three. Gosh darn it, I keep thinking about, uh, data. <laughs> dirt, dirt for the old, for his, uh, what's it, uh, for his melon farm. You know, dirt, dirt block, dirt, dirt block. Let's see here. Here, two, here, and total of, oh, oopsies, total of three here, and need to recover one, ow. There we go. All right, we can now start on the next layer. Next trio, I should say. I have a total of uh, five left. Actually, you know, you got me thinking about the lodestone there, ONG. Um, um, for the game. I haven't really tried the lodestone yet. I forget what they do, but I know they added it. So. Go, we're almost there. Ow. Ah, sweet, I made it. Yay. Head on back over here to the uh, descent. I need to go get some more uh, blocks. Also needed to get something to drink. Let's see. Uh, double check here. Nope. Need more dark oak. So let's go get some. We'll take half this chest. Yeah, I just wish there was a um a, a woodcutter 
block. You know how like there's, you know, like right here there's a stone cutter. Just wish we had a what if it, this should be the same trader. Oh. I wish we could have a um, woodcutter block. That way, you know, we could uh, more accurately um, cut. Um, Wood. Well, that's just my opinion. That we'll finish up these guys uh, layer by layer because we got that guy right there. All right, we are almost, we are quite literally to the top of our roof. So what we'll do next is uh, we'll um, decide on our theme for, um, for the main level there. want the um um uh, yeah, uh, to be you know the um eating area careful not to go too far over because, you know, go splat. And tree need, need I do not need go splat. There we go. So let's see here. I want to double check the, um, it'll be two blocks up on these guys. And that's right, we also need to take out the one here from the end. So one, two, three, and four, and then So let's see here. Well, let's go ahead here. Let's um, clad some of the roof here. Also need to tabulate the um, oops. The thing here in the middle. Oh, look at that. <laughs> Inadvertently. Oh. Uh, 
No. You out of the way. Hate when I do stuff like that. Oops. The Department of Duh. I'm going to quickly make up some more stairs. And then, what we need to do is calcu quickly calculate from the ends. Because I, I still want to have uh, this right here. Uh, like it is. So let's see. Um, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, twenty-three, twenty-five, twenty-six, twenty-seven, twenty-eight. 29, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36, 37, 39, 40, 41, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 50, 51, 2, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 59. Well, let's see. 59 divided by 2, so it'll be block 30. So, 1, 2, This is, should be block 30. We'll cut it out and then we'll come double check from this side. Make sure we have an even count. So one, That's 30. It's confirmed. Ta-da! We have our middle bit. Huzzah! Twee is officially used as brain place. <laughs> Not that I don't use my brain place. That's, um... Yeah, I'll definitely have to come in and, um... Um... Put together some sort of, uh... Lighting. I'll probably, um... What I'll probably do is, um, um, is, um, what I'll probably do is, um, take off, you know, one side and, you know, work from one side to determine the, um, middle, to determine a count ratio for the, um, at least the very top here. On glowstone, so I want to have glowstone. That's what I traditionally use. Um, and um, so let's go ahead here. We're just going to deposit our stuff here. There's that. Let's quickly um, head to bed so we don't have a. Uh, Darkness.
Yeah, like I said, it's usually uh, when I'm not streaming that I usually work through the night, so <clears throat> just a second. Okay, so if it's getting dark, a little bit dark IRL, so I need my backlight so I can be able to see. All right, so now let's see here. Um, I need to do. Um, just gonna go with the typical uh, style. Yes, uh, here. Gotta wait for the swirl to load back up. But basically, just gonna go with the um, typical style of. Um, Having, you know, these, having sets of tables and all that, so, um, um, with some disorder, let's see, this one, that's right, I did it like this. With just sort of, you know, self-serving tables, and, you know, and people, you know, would just, you know, stand around and uh, eat, you know, sort of uh, like a um, regular thing. Let's pull, quickly pull up 113 World. Ah. So that's right. I was busy checking something else for the uh, um, for potential uh, for the string farm here in this world. I wanted to see if I really want to do go do a string farm. Let's quickly hop up uh, to the grand pavilion up here. It was like, I seem to remember having some sort of bed over here. Ah. Oh, that's right. I want to get myself some Podzol. God, what was I wanting that for? I was like, gosh darn it. There was, I was thinking of Podzol. I was like, I want, want Podzol for some. Oh, 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 oh. Ah, <laughs> um, yeah, I think we'll do something like this, um, for this, so, um, um, that's what I was wanting to do. I was wanting Podzol for the, um, step up there, so, um, So I'm thinking what we can do is create some service tables here in the corners. Oops. Yeah, service of some, some service tables here in each of the corners. That's what I was wanting Podzel for, is the, um, oops, double oops, is for, um, 
some of the aesthetics that I want to do up on top of the, uh, the industrial building here. <clears throat> let's go ahead here. Let's get some of our wool. My pops. Thing of black wool right there. I have a, oh wait, do have some black ink? Yep, black dye. Oh, that's right. Put. Uh, What I'm wanting to do here for these guys is, uh, for these service tables, I want to do a checkerboard pattern. Let's get this out of the way so I can pull out the black carpet. These guys will be this sort of theme right here. And then we'll do the opposite on this side. Obviously I'm done goofing. Relaxed. A little bit keeps the same basic sort of theme, but at the same time, does a little bit of um, variance. So, what we need to do now is um, ooh, that would be a good idea. I just gave myself an idea. Let's see here. I want to do. Again. Oops, that was smart. Uh, looks like we're off by just one block. Let's double check. That's one block difference. So. Do so twee. darn it there's this uh anime i've watched called madlax and um 
I'm suddenly thinking about in the series last episode. So we'll have to do it like a little bit like this. Now that'll have to be like that. Actually. Gave himself an idea. Oh, yeah, I'm suddenly thinking about back to Mad Lax of, uh, Final confrontation between uh, Margaret and um, Friday, Monday, and um, uh, what happens is is that uh, she, uh, you know, he thinks he can try to get her to do what he wants her to do, and um, she. Um, decides to uh, rebel and um, um, so um, I forget the guy I'm forgetting the name of the, God who was it that played um, Friday Monday? Was uh, Mike Kinehens? Oh, he died in uh, two thousand eight. Was fifty six. Let me go ahead here and. Um, Post a link to his Wikipedia article. But uh, yeah, I'm just remembering um, in that in their final confrontation, um, how he, um, how they had him go, Margaret. <laughs> you know. Uh, let's see. Yeah. It was Mad Lux. Uh, he also played in Chrono Crusade, Excel Saga, Full Metal Panic series, Neon, Genesis Evangelon, Director's Cut. Oh, he was also in Noir. I, I, I love the... Um, I love... Um, Yeah, it was B Train. It was their Girls with Guns trilogy. I was trying to remember the studio. I was like, it was, it was something. It was something train. So, um, um, let's see here. 
So then, yeah, Margaret goes, I'm a bad little girl Friday, Monday. Well, yeah, that, that's one of the things I remember from that is I'm a bad little girl Friday, Monday. <laughs> I thought that was uh, a little bit of a, uh, an interesting design choice to have a character by the name of Friday, Monday. Well, let's go ahead here. want to go back over here. Let's go get some um, lapis. That's redstone. There we go. Let's get some lapis. And then get some wool. Let me, uh, uh, I do have a thing there of a carpet. And we'll break that all the way down into blue dye. Blue is, of course, one of Twee's favorite colors. So for these guys... On both sides, we'll follow the same, oops, same sort of basic pattern here. I'll have these guys be like this. White Cat is moaning in his sleep. Now we'll finish up doing this uh, design work uh, on, you know, finish fitting this out um, on Thursday. Yeah, had I woken up on time, we would have uh, been able to do a little bit more. But you know, it's life is life. Oops. should hopefully have some more uh, I should de definitely hopefully have the um, knock on wood uh, some uh, glowstone and um, the, um, the roof done because we need some light it's, it's like a thing of darkness up there it's like Aah! I want to see the underside, you know. It's one of these things uh, is that I like seeing the underside. Get that out of the way. This is looking pretty neat. Gosh darn it. I want to watch Mad Lax now. I was actually uh, seen it um, at a friend's house. Seen the uh, Girls with Guns trilogy. And um, so I wanted to uh, get it for myself, and I was actually able to find a copy of uh, the Mad Lax series first. Um, oops. And then, um, uh, I had to go to the fun of, well, I was, I was like, who, who was it that translate, who did the English, who has the current rights? I was like, oh, it's Funimation, so. I went in ahead and ordered uh, some uh, the discs uh, from Funimation. <clears throat> Excuse me. And um, that was that. Go ahead and make 
actually need to hold on to that string. That way I can set it up for the item sorter. I was about to convert it all into wool, and I was like, wait a minute, tree, use your brain. Oops. So yeah, for um, next episode... Uh, we'll be finishing off, uh, at least doing the floor work here on the Grand Pavilion. We have at least a start. Um, so hopefully, uh, off camera, I'll get some glowstone. I'll, um, I'll get some glowstone, be able to put stuff in the roof. I might actually just go ahead and, you know, like tear out the setter beam here and you know just carefully you know select and put in select stuff i'll put in i'll finish putting in the roof you know the stairs that is you know that's gonna be one of these tedious sorts of things that i'll do off camera and then whatever uh time we got left um i'll do a little bit of uh we'll have to do some uh tree farming because uh one of the things i want to do up here excuse me uh, up here on the top of the roof is um, I want to take some of that you know the nether stuff um, and basically sort of create you know all over here sort of an evil garden is uh, what's going on in my tree brain so that we'll we'll at least see what we can do to get started on that on next oh let's take a look and see it look see over here at the stuff but yeah have an evil garden let's take a look see and that is of course the sugar cane farm don't want that side we want this side there we go there's home oh yeah it's looking swell and once we like i said once we get the uh the wood uh the stairs and that'll look hell heck of a lot uh huh so um yeah we're gonna go ahead here guys it's time for us to go ahead and head on a raid because of course i gotta go to work so um let me see who is live who is live who is live who is live um but yeah if you're watching here on twitch at twitch.tv slash osage orange um please remember to go ahead and hit that follow button if you are watching over on the YouTubes, over at youtube.com slash Orange zero one please remember, uh, I mean, the, the, the Osage Orange Gaming, please remember to hit that follow button, hit that subscribe button, hit that bell icon for notifications. And, of course, it really does help out. And, of course, please uh, make sure to follow over on the Twitters at twitter.com slash OsageOrange01. I'm going to go say hi here to Princess Lissy. She's currently playing some Minecraft, so I thought, why not go ahead and give you uh, some fun and joy with her? She's currently doing her own uh, build a project on hardcore, so um, I myself could not do hardcore because it's, of course, I die too much. Don't want to build and suddenly fall off something and die, you know. So anyway, hope to catch you guys on uh, Thursday with another episode of uh, Let's Play Minecraft season Series 2 uh, with more construction. Saturday with some more city building Saturdays and of course Sunday with another episode of Titan Quest the Loot Grind. So let's go ahead here and get this raid party started. I appreciate everybody who has come out and I hope to catch y'all in the next episode. Ta-ta for now.